What's up, YouTube? Sea Dog back with another Transformers Cyberverse review. This is on the Cyberverse Ultra Class Bash Attack Optimus Prime. Checking him out in his packaging. You could, of course, rip him right out of the packaging like this. Get to see the cool artwork. Very cool artwork. Definitely digging that. And I do like the Ultimate Class. That's more my favorite one, but this is fun to have too. See Cyberverse, Hasbro, Blast, or Bash Attack, excuse me, Transformers. And then you can see it transforms in 12 steps and shows the Bash Attack gimmick. And you get a little bio, Noble Leader. <laughs> and we get some cross cells. I still need to get myself a slipstream. So moving on. So before I continue, I want to remind you guys to share with your friends. Check out me on Twitter at cdogcdog4, all lowercase, no spaces. That's cdogcdog4. Link will be in the description below. Make sure to click on that notification bell and click on all videos to get all of my videos as they come in. And also to check out my playlists. And I uh, have playlists on the Transformers Cyberverse, Transformers Siege, Transformers Movie 1 through 3, uh, you name it, Masterpiece, whatever. Also, check out SozyStore.com and uh, for all your third party and official needs, free shipping to the US, great competitive prices. That's SozyStore.com. Link will be in the description in about a day or so. If I put it in right away, it screws up my video. All right, so let's get to Optimus Prime. So here he is, nice colors. As you can see, we've got a little articulation here. Got some bicep swivel. Got the outer shoulder. And we have rotation. So not bad. And you get the bend in the elbow at 90. You get the head will swivel 360 degrees. Got you got a nice close-up of the head. It's very cool. Definitely looks Optimus Prime. And really nothing at the waist. You get a little motion, but you're not going to really do anything with it. But you can kick up and out. And that's really all you get for articulation. But checking out the details, you get those little arrows painted in. You get the nice blue with the black border painted for his chest. You get the silver paint on his face as, long, as well as the blue painted eyes or optics. Silver paint for his thighs painted all the way around and on his... Uh, grill section as well as some black paint here for his knees and his vents on his legs a little bit on his feet you get plastic pinned on wheels that's what he looks like from the back uh, a shield right on the back and he does have a shield like that in the show to transform him it's pretty simple you just kind of want to have the arms out like this to start and then you have two pegs right here you're going to pull those pegs off. See, there's a couple of ports right there and there. And there's the pegs, actually. So you just get peg them when you're going back in there, just like that. But you want to unpeg them like this. You're going to lift this up and rotate it around like so. And then you're going to take this peg, or this kind of slot thing, and slot it right in there. Make sure you slot that in good. Just like that. You're gonna take the head, rotate it 180 degrees, and then flip it back. You're gonna replace his arms back down. We're gonna do the Optimus Prime G1 thing, where you rock this back, and then these come in over our top. Just like so. Oops, got that. Let's get it down a little bit. Just like that. And then you're gonna squeeze, make sure everything's pegged in nicely. You're gonna take this that together like that and this is the truck mode technically not the full one so keep watching but that's one of the truck modes so as you can see it rolls and then push that forward luckily mine doesn't automatically shoot up it's kind of cool that you can actually take pictures like this with it short so it does help because some of them I think just automatically flip up mine actually just kind of clips but it, that's the gimmick. It has this little slide function right there. And then you get that nice profile of the real, what he really looks like in the show. And this looks a lot like the animated version. I love the Autobot symbols that are tampoed on. Got a little more paint right here. 
And then you get the Autobot shield like that. Very cool. You get some silver paint here. And then as well as bordering around the headlights, which are painted and picked out in bright yellow. This is painted in this nice white paint with blue paint gloss kind of on top. It's the same color as this. And you've even got some blue here up on the upper lights. Got the Autobot symbols tampoed. Very cool. He does roll in this mode as well. And then to transform him back, flip this, slide that, pull these out, just like so. Kind of lift up, slide these out. And you want to raise that out like this. Like that. I'm gonna raise his head up, rotate that back, unpeg it there, rotate this around as you flip this down, peg this into place, make sure that these two tabs are pegged back in, and separate the legs, which unfortunately doesn't have knees, but probably could build some, and there you go, Optimus Prime. Let me know what you think of the review, leave a like if you liked the video, subscribe for more toy reviews, and as always, stay awesome, stay subbed, and stay tuned for the next video. Peace, it's a wrap, guys, I want.